Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. I'm David Carroll, your Las Vegas realtor with Signature Real Estate Group. And today we're here at Everly by Toll Brothers, located out here in Cadence in Henderson, Nevada. Have a look around. It's warming up out here today, 99 degrees. We should reach 100 degrees today. Now here at Everly, they do have three floor plans to choose from. They have the Harlan, the Layton, and the Kelton. Square footage starts from 2031 up to 2406 plus. These are single story beauties. Now here at Everly, they have a total of 91 home sites. Beautiful modern single story homes. And today we're gonna to be featuring the Kelton model. It starts as a three bedroom, three full baths with a three car garage, 2,215 square feet. They do have three exterior elevations and pricing is starting today at $591,995. Let's take a closer look. So it looks like they are gonna be moving their sales center here. Beautiful lattice work. This is your three car garage. If we can take a quick peek inside. Getting it set up for their sales office. Love having the versatility of a three car garage. Now for exteriors, you have your choice of the Spanish Contemporary, the Modern Craftsman, and the Modern Farmhouse. We're looking at the Modern Farmhouse here today. Now there is about a $5,000 upcharge per elevation as you go up. Spanish Contemporaries at the base 591, then you have the Modern Craftsman at 596, Farmhouse at 601k to start. I love how Toll Brothers installs these kiosks here for your mail. No more porch pirates. In Toll Brothers fashion, look at the tile entry. 12 by 24s. Gorgeous stacked stone. I did want to mention you do get paver stones included in your driveway and they're in modern variety. I love this gray color. Your coach lighting. Single LED, eight foot upgraded modern door. Let's head inside. Now welcome to the Kelton model here at Everly by Toll Brothers. I do want to mention that the Kelton does have a similar floor plan to the C Clavel that's located out in Sky Canyon. And one thing different about the Clavel is on the entry, you got a half or a three quarter bath open to the hall here. Where on this home, it's tucked in straight to the suite. Let's take a look at that first. Here's bedroom number one. 11.5 by 10.1 square feet and this is the suite right off of the entry now one thing beautiful about these homes is you get 10 foot ceilings included they have added some extra leds and a fan of light pre-wire on this one look at the design now all this is upgraded here's your slide in closet Pretty deep, I'd say. And these are eight foot doors, two panel. And here is your bath. It has been upgraded. We got the 24 by 12 tiles on the floor. Now you do get three choices to choose from. This one is an upgraded tile, but they have a really cool looking gray one that comes included, which I think is a winner. Here's your upgraded shower. This has been upgraded to the walk-in shower and lots of tile work. Also pulled up all the way to the top. So you've got multiple options. You got the tile option. You got the option to bring it up to the ceiling. Upgraded chrome, chrome hardware. Look at that one. Reminds me of something off Aliens almost. Let's flip it around. We do have upgraded baseboards, orange peel texture. Upgraded hardware package for sure. This one's very modern. I like that. No more losing your toilet paper roll. And they've also upgraded this toilet. With Toll Brothers, you're going to have hundreds of options to upgrade. Your oval undermount. You got the spread on the hardware and this beautiful cultured marble. Two and a half inch on the edge. They've got the European style doors urban effects, modern pools. These typically tend to be the ones that a lot of people will choose on their modern. OK, 
cabinets. Although I like the traditional pulls on the modern cabinets. Let me turn here real quick. Here's a lot of the options that they have included in here. So if you want to pause it real quick. Look at this entry. Nice flat modern entry there. Nine foot opening on that one. And they pulled the tile throughout the home. They got it kind of running across the grain here. Let me show you this living room, this kitchen and dining. First thing I notice is those stacked uppers, the cabinetry. You have multiple structural options you can do in here. You can do the 12 8 multi stack slide at the great room. Now you also have options to do that slider in the primary bedroom as well. You got the luxury primary bath. You have a couple of different uh, kitchen island design configurations you can do. Now one of the first things I feel in this kitchen is just the volume. Having the 10 foot ceilings and the nice wide open floor plan definitely adds a lot of character. I do want to mention that the floor plans they have in Sky Canyon, the real difference is these plans are just a little bit larger square footage. You get like another three feet in the kitchen kind of adds to the square footage. It is beautiful. Microwave down below. So it is an option to bring this up if you do the gourmet kitchen, if you do the double oven. Just had a client the other day was asking about this and it is kind of a low feeling. It is a little bit low to access that microwave, but I think it works. It kind of keeps you from using the microwave so much. That's how I see it. 42 inch with the stacked uppers. You got the lower trim and the flat modern crown. Looking at upgraded cords as well. This one looks like a high level, like a level five. Got the two and a half inch upgraded edge. LEDs, backsplash, multiple upgrades here. Now in the kitchen area, it's about 20 feet, 20 feet, five inches by 13, seven. Great open space. You really got to feel it. Got the three pendant lights and the pre-wires. Here's your island. They have this one equipped with the farm style edge upgraded sink. All porcelain. One thing I like about this one is the width. It has so much width. It does have a little bit of a slope coming in, but very wide. Not as deep as some of the stainless. And I love this hardware. I would just do a brush nickel at minimum, but that is beautiful. They have upgraded your kitchen package, KitchenAid upgraded package with the chrome tub. Take a look down below. We have our garbage disposal switch down here as well. Like having the extra electrical and power. On the drawers, these are the urban effects. Full dovetail, soft clothes, undermount glides. Where are those cookies? Looks like we have some grains in here today. Here's your pantry. It's got the French door. Loving the double stack. It's probably about a $7,000, $7,000 upgrade, or maybe eight to get that double stack, but it is really impressive. If it's in the budget, I would go for it. It's kind of like the super shower. You're gonna be in here cooking every single day. Got the modern KitchenAid vent hood. And look at this KitchenAid range. I don't know, the cooktops are cool, but the range in its full glory. Nice clean knobs. Got the five burner. And they pulled this towel backsplash all the way up, not all the way past the hood vent, but now it's one take a little bit of a step back and look at the lighting. Looks like we have six LEDs over the kitchen. They've also added a four pack with the chandelier pre-wire in the living room, two of them to be exact. Actually, we're looking at a six pack of LEDs and two chandelier lightings. How did I even miss that? Now here you do have the option to upgrade to the center slide glass door and she is a beauty. Here to the left, we do have our casual dining. It's about 13, nine by 10. Great space. Now, 
tile, you will get tile included in all the wet areas. You will get carpet in the dry. So you kind of get, just get your kitchen tiled up and then you're going to have carpet everywhere else. You can upgrade the standard throughout or change the tile completely. Let's take a look out back. It is warming up out there today. 99 degrees, almost 100. Now here is the Kelton's backyard. It has been upgraded. When you do purchase, you will get this covered patio included, but it'll be all dirt back here. So let your imagination run wild. And I can hear that water. I am the water bearer. Let's go check it out. You got concrete pads, artificial turf, river rocks. That is gorgeous. I could totally handle a large hot tub like this without having the pool. Inviting for sure. Now a little bit about Everly here at Cadence is they have a total of 91 home sites. They currently have four dirt lots available. Also, they got two quick move-ins coming up. If you stay tuned to the end, I'll show you those quick move-ins. HOA out here is only $40 a month. We're located in Cadence in Henderson, Nevada. You got access to Cadence Park, all the trails, hiking out here. Look at this option on the bedroom. That is another option that I think is totally worth it. Having that multi-slide right off of your primary bed. She's a beauty. Looks like on the side they did add some floodlights as options. You also got some camera, uh, pre-wires and electrical. So when it comes to electrical and low voltage, you can pretty much wire up your whole house with ethernet, cameras, electrical, whatever you need. What a beautiful day. Look at this backyard. Got good space here on the side and I like how they have their pool equipment hidden away here on the side. It's about 11 to 12 month build time here at Everly. Lot sizes range from about 6,300. Now they do have some that are 65 and then larger than that, just a couple handfuls. And welcome back in. Let's go ahead and take a look at the primary suite. We're right here in the rear of the house. 16 one by 14 square feet. They pulled the tile as well, I love it. Love it when you get nice hardwood or hard flooring throughout. Modern lighting, four can light option. And this room is this huge. You got a nice large bedboard, headboard on your bed. <laughs> I have a slider off of my primary and I use it every single day. It's just great access when you need to hop in the backyard. Now here's the primary bath. Have your water closet tucked on the side, upgraded toilet. You do have the his and her vanities, upgraded cords, upgraded cabinetry. Take a closer look here. Oval undermounts, chrome hardware with the spread. We are looking at a four inch backsplash as well. Now one thing you can do is you could literally chip that off, have the mirrors not installed and then add some custom mirrors later on if you'd like. It's your walk-in closet. And then I want to see that shower. Great size on the closet. Loving the window as well. I believe that's an option to get that window. Now here is your bath, your shower, tiled to the ceiling. Look at this one. Oh my goodness. It's like a cave. Porcelain tiles. Kind of feels like you're at the beach almost. They got the two by two on the floor. A little beigey color. Brush trim, brush steel. I love it. I don't know something about the showers that I just love. So here she is, your living room, cafe, dining, kitchen. 42 inch cabinets with the stacked uppers. They are beautiful. Now, as we head to the middle of the house, you do, it does come standard here as your dining room area. It would be all opened up. Then you have options to turn it into the den. 
you can turn it into flex space number one, flex space number two. So this looks like flex space number one where it adds the side walls, but again, this does come standard open. What a huge space. The 10 foot ceilings, it's definitely grand. What a great space for an office. All tiled up. Kind of spinning around here. They got the four LED stereo speakers because she's a model. Now let's go head straight to the back. Now here in the back, we do have bedroom number three. It's about 13 by 11 three. And they've customized it. Look at this closet setup or cabinetry. Beautiful, we got the sliding closet, eight foot doors, two panel. Kind of just spin it around here on this corner. Now here on the floor, it does look like they added some ethernet for your internet. Now with your low voltage, you'll be able to put those in any room that you like. You do get two locations standard. I'd be leaving the great room and the primary. Now here is access to the audio video, which is your closet. A little bit smaller of a door here. Now here is your full bath right off of this downstairs bedroom. They've tiled this one up as well. Beautiful upgrade all the way up. I like these little small tiles. So cute, gives it a great effect. Now this will come standard as a tub and shower fiberglass combo. And if we spin it around, here's your upgraded tops, quartz. And look at this hardware. Isn't that something? This niche here comes uh, without the lowers and upper cabinets, all standard in the niche. And right next door, we have our washroom. Optional lower with the sink. Looks like they've gone with a beige uh, quartz, a nice two and a half inch edge, standard sink, standard hardware, washer dryer are optional. And look at the casing. So you do get the five inch casing on the base and then four inch casing around the door. Pretty sweet and in Toll Brothers fashion. Look at these casings. That does not come included. And then here's your entry. So you got bedroom number one, bedroom number two here in the middle, your flex room, kitchen, dining, living, and your primary in the rear. All right, guys, now we're in the community. I did want to mention that it is not a gated community. So here's kind of like one of the entrances into the community. They have two quick move-ins for sale. So here on the right, we have lot number 29. 832 Canterbury Street. It's four bedroom, three bath, 2,179 square feet. It does have the 12 foot multi-slide door at the great room, alternative kitchen island. Also has the lower kitchen cabinets. They got this one priced with lot premiums and options for $714,995. Now, if we just spin it around, we also have lot number 33. This one's the Layton, 2,406 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half baths, got the three car garage. They have upgraded the alternate kitchen island, 12 foot slide at the great room, nine foot slide at the primary bedroom. Got the laundry sink with lower cabinets and the home office upgrade. Pricing on this one is, where is the pricing at? 782,995, that's all in. Now, if you ever do business with me, I'll be doing video tours while your home is being built. Just love watching new construction get built. like they're getting ready to finish all the wiring in here and put in some insulation pre drywall orientation so pretty much what you'll have is you'll they'll do all their plumbing they'll do all their HVAC and then right after that they'll do all the electrical once the windows are in and then they're gonna get ready to wrap and insulate so this is kind of like your last opportunity to see the home before they fill it with insulation All right, guys, you have a wonderful day. Hit that like button for me, and we'll see you on the next one.